Alright people, welcome back. More value and wine. So today is Wednesday, and that means that we are using ULXs. So I can't remember, I think last time ULXs I just got my butt kicked over and over again because they're a hella difficult opponents. I don't know, I can't remember. All, all these videos start to run together for me. Like what what episode is this? Five twenty five twenty six, twenty seven or twenty eight? No, sorry. No Espanol. Yeah, I mean, I mean, you asked me, Daniel. You know, can you speak Spanish? I took three years of Spanish in high school, so the answer is no. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I love that shit. <laughs> Like, if you're in high school or you're going to high school and you're, you're taking a language class, get out. Just, no. No, 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 no. That shit's not working. That shit is not going to work. <laughs> I swear. I didn't learn. Oh, shit. Yep. I didn't learn a lick of fucking Spanish. Like, there's still a couple words I know and picking phrases and stuff that I can still pick up on. But, you know, I cannot have a, a coherent conversation with you. Definitely no. Definitely no. <laughs> yeah, that's not even the language I want to learn. If I could learn any language, just like, like, bam, all of a sudden, automatically, I know the language. I would learn Japanese. You know, I watch a lot of anime, a lot of common writers, so I would love to just go ahead and learn some Jap. My opponent see here sets a whole bunch of background. I got two limit reversers, which is just awesome. So you guys know what to do. Monsters beat back row. So unless he wants to mirror force or deprison my Armageddon Knight. I'm gonna get Knight served his job, so literally his job now, poke. Still not in the mood to be set in that MST. Yeah. I don't wanna set a card and then he'll be like, alright, end phase, MST. Let me guess, heroes? I haven't seen Summer the only deck I've seen Summer Monk in is Heroes, so. Oh, something DDR related. Like, okay. Like I said, I haven't seen Summer Monk as much. The only deck I've seen him is Heroes, so. Oh, okay. Well, I'm gonna get a knight. I'm gonna get a knight. Fat. Yep. Drop the mallet. Oh, it's like plague licious, like Mally and plague spreader. XC into Lavalval chain. Yeah. Ugh, I'm not. In a, I'm not in a good. Oh, hello. Fucking cheating ass giant hand. Cause everybody has a giant hand. It's like a fucking what six. $700 fucking card. Let me just start in my extra deck because I fucking can. Like, alright. God, John Hand puts me out of commission. I can't change my battle position. The giant Hand and some back row. Like, I thought he was going to go in the level chain, like detach and send the, the plague spreader. That's what I thought he was going to do, but... Giant hand is like, listen up, motherfucker, I'm gonna fuck you up. Like, okay. Really? Yeah, let's say, really? Well, now I know you have a bottomless, so I know exactly what that must see. Ha! Ah, your misplays are my pleasure. I got Galax Wizard. That's what you get, bitch. We're misplaying. See? I knew I should have had onto my MST because I'm just going to be like, you know what? Let's face that. Thank you for revealing that, so. Alright. Uh, I guess I'll summon Terror and then John Ham will go ahead and negate me. And yeah, he'll kill me. I'll summon Ultimate Nightmare. Yeah, that sounds like a fine, fine plan. What's up? Yeah, go ahead. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and... I'm going to summon Galaxy Wizard, because at this point, if he wants to go ahead and turn go ahead. I don't care. So. Effects. I'm going to tribute for cost. Let's go ahead and get me a Galaxy Queen's Light. Where are you? Man? I need to get Eris in the grave. If I can get Eris, man. At the plays. 
All right, go ahead and uh, turn the defense. Doesn't start a chain. I'm just dead. So I'll get my effect. Some terror. Then he'll giant hand my terror, which is fine. Then I'll set the limit reverse, and I could just do the play over again, and I'll have an ultimate nightmare too. All right, increase terror effect. Then join the me, which is totally fine. So I cannot change my battle position. My effect is negated, right? So it's missing me. Okay. Okay. Good. Totally fine with that. Dude, here it's like a glorified fiendish chain. Affecting rave. Oh, now the effect. <coughs> so I guess he drew a plague spreader? Or he's, oh, he has the plague spreader this entire time. I have no idea. Hmm, banish Mally, summon Mally. Alright. Now someone plague, and I'm be like, oh shit. <laughs> yep. Wow. <clears throat> I hope he's about to go for the scrap dragon play. I'm about to get. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm um, but um, oh my god, sugiri sugiri, this guy is gonna want my booty. And mm -mm 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 -mm. they put that card on top, summon it back, go into scrap dragon, you know, run over my monster. Well, I think it's if you kill my monster, yeah, you should go into battle phase, kill me, then main phase two, scrap dragon me. Cause if, you, if you scrap dragon me now. Then I'll only come back stronger. Another Beals. Alright. Uh, that play was kind of anti climactic to tell you the truth. I really thought you were going to go for more structured plays like Scrap Dragon Beals. What's the point of having double Beals? Okay. Still not in the best of <coughs> situations right now, especially if he has like a D prison or a mirror force or something. Well, D prison more. Mirror force, I can always change the limit risk and summon and summon terror back again. But D prison, like it's the Beals plus the background. I, I can handle the Beals. That, that is no problem. Okay. 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 What was I supposed to do? I forgot his name. I should have kept his message. Right. Sh. 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 Terror again. <clears throat> God, I need something to put Eris in the graveyard so I can start my place. Now, top deck into an Armageddon Knight right now would be great. So bottomless and turn tool. Right. Still has Kapol, Swarming, oh, Ring of Destiny. There are so many trap cards. <laughs> Let's say this card cannot be destroyed in battle, so. Still nothing. Go ahead. 
Bill State, Terror States, Bill State, Terror States. Just like, okay. Nothing can happen right now. Until I fucking draw into. That's Chameleon. That's not what I needed. Especially with Eris. That would have been nice, but nope. Not that Black Rising would have done much, especially with double Beals. And now he's just building up his back row again. Uh, of course. And I still get my effects, so I'll still get to summon Ultimate Nightmare, but. Lots of background, like, damn. Yeah, there's a guy who's like, summon Beals, and then one up my opponent with background until they can't absolutely not play you again anymore. Like, okay. That's how it is. Mm. I said, if you want to go ahead and finish train me, finish train me. That's fine. Now I know you have a finish train now. Oasis. So if I had to use Yubel as a dummy to, you know, bat out all of his background, then I totally don't mind that. To prepare for future plays. Is that what you're going to do right now? Being this chain, tat, tat? If that's what you want to do. Did that part just crash? I mean, did Dion just crash? I can't click anything. I think Dion's falling apart. Okay, internet is fine. I have no idea what the fuck's going on. Like, okay, Dion's being weird. You gonna pull, you, you, you crashing Dion? You, 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 you falling apart? You going down? Oh, internet is fine. Uh, it's not my internet, so I have no idea what's up. Yeah, I think I think something's oh, shit. up. What's wrong? What's today? The seventh? Really? No play. Oh. <laughs> 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 hmm. Alright, well, be right back I guess. Okay, it's been a little while. Hopefully DN is better. It was DN, it wasn't my internet, because, you know, everything else was working fine, YouTube was working fine, just DN was just like, oh, going down, like, alright, not sure how that duel would have played out anyway, you know, eventually he would have got around my plays, so, and it didn't seem like I was drawing into what I needed to draw anyway. Let's try this again, well, you guys already know how I feel about this hand. I'm doing it right now. Hand is actually kind of crap. You know, I hate drawing you bell. I always do. It's like the worst shit to fucking draw. So pretty much if I don't get Dark Graffer, there's not much I'm going to do with this hand. You know, I'm going to take this little slow. My opponent doesn't seem like he's the best. He's on a 50, 60 card deck, so I'm going to take the little slow. But I got to take a couple of hits on the chin just to, you know, eventually draw into too many cards and allow myself to pitch you bell. So be it. Because, God, this hand is... Just like wow, like I, 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 drawing you is like well, I want to send Eris and Eris can search you, so you're not the best to draw. To draw. You I never want to draw you. Oh my god, it's fucking Thunder King, like number generator. Why? It's a sixty card deck. Like here you go, Thunder King. Like thanks. And then I draw fucking. See if I didn't draw you, Bell, I'd be sitting <clears throat> so fine right now. But of course I do. So. Am I literally going to lose to a 60 card deck? I might. Like I said, you got, you got one of the best combinations in Yu-Gi-Oh. Thunder King plus back row. Thunder King plus back row equals you're getting fucked up today. So, well, you know what? I finally got you, Bell. Right, right. 
Josh Strong all the limit. You just rub it in my face. You're like, ha ha, look at all these limit verses. Don't you wish you had your belt in the graveyard, huh? See about you drew it. Like, no, I don't know. Thanks. Opponent's sitting here beating the living shit out of me, but I still think my play was practical, to say the least. Cost me over half my life points. Wow, now he doesn't all of a sudden he doesn't want to attack. Like, okay. I said this card cannot be destroyed by battle. This card cannot be destroyed. That's all except by the card effect. This card is summoned, toss a coin, and go. Uh, okay, I guess he. Oh, this is mandatory. When this card is summoned, oh. Uh, you need to do uh, four effects. I didn't know it was mandatory. When this card is summoned, toss a coin, Harry Tails. Okay. It's mandatory. I don't know how to spell mandatory. Okay. Negate your card effects that target this card and destroy them. Okay. Hmm. And I'll just summon Armageddon Knight. I said Thunder King plus some back row is seriously gonna fuck me up, but hopefully I can make it through this duel. No, Thunder King can only stop inherent summons, so yeah, he can't touch you well, but you know, he can. Uh, you know what? I can go ahead and send Dragon. Let me see if I can snipe out some of this back row. Let's actually see if it's actually some good back row. Or some shitty back row. I guess I'll go ahead and attack the fool. He'll take 14, and Donner King will attack me, but eh, I don't care. Fair enough. Fair. The grave effect. Sensitive card effect is sent by the card effect. Okay. Read back row. Sure. So like I said, Thunder King can only stop inherent summons, so. Don't worry about that. Really, I just gotta worry about all the back row. So. So ahead and get our revival on. We finally got Ubel in the graveyard, so now we can start doing some Ubel plays. What's this do? Uh. Negate your card effects that target this card and destroy them. Act as the target. Um, you can't. You can't do that. You can't target the fool. Or your card will get destroyed. Act this by targeting one monster you control. You target the fool. Therefore, fool's going to destroy your dimension gate. So, yeah. Because you land on heads. Negate your card effects that target this card and destroy them. Alright, so Thunder King attack. I will take the 500. You can have that, and when I'm mad, so it's a note this is. So far, it doesn't seem like there's been a lot of the, you know, the GC back row. Oop, that is not what I wanted to activate. In reverse. What's this card do? When you're. When the effect of a face up spell trap card. Activated, destroy that card. Also, I this card. You can do that. Yeah, I guess so. Oh. 
Draw. Alright, still not a terrible situation. Go ahead and turn the defense mode. Destroy you. Fact. But pretty much every single time I activate one of my continuous, you know, cards, you can just pop it and then reset it. That's kind of annoying, to say the least. I want you in the graveyard anyway, so. So I'll go ahead and just attack you again. You'll take another 15. I'll bring your life points down anyway. I can bait you out with some back row too. That's that's fine too. Let's just go ahead and attack you. <sighs> Terror effect. You can go ahead and chain that and banish your Thunder King if you want to. You can save him if you want to. <clears throat> Fool's gonna die, but no. How for it? He's like, no, 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 just let him die. Like, okay. Thunder King's a very powerful card. I thought you wanted to keep him. I thought you could activate that and hopped away. Oh, my kingdom for making a super chocolate fudge covered. Me level three. I need Eris in the graveyard. Alright, he's gonna have to wait call. That's fine. I'm back Thunder King. Alright. Gun to level 4. Make a cast out. That would be the most optimal play. So I'm gonna make a cast out. Nope, I'm just gonna leave it like that. Cool. Kill him again. Thanks for using your call of the hunted. Definitely gotta kill Thunder King. Can't have him on the field when I'm, you know, trying to do XC plays. Just being able to negate inherent summons is just so powerful. You can destroy it anytime. During, during each of my own phases. It's gone too. Go ahead. <clears throat> Actually, you know, I should summon Galaxy with him and tribute him. He's a butt ton of back row. I don't I only know what one of them is. Still getting the message in the bottle, but I can't fucking use them. My double background, my double activate. Like activate heal chain, and I'll have to again chain. So I'm gonna get a knight. So go ahead and drop Eris, and I can start doing some plays. That got a fun idea to me. Yeah. So, activate. Okay. No, I'm training your card, and then I'll chain. The card's annoying. Super annoying against me. I guess reset. Sure. Ah. <laughs> and by sure, I mean you can't do that. Nope. <laughs> How much attack does Armageddon Knight have? <laughs> hmm? Huh? Hmm? How much attack does he have and how much attack is required for bottom ones? Hmm? 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 Huh? Hmm? Hmm? Let you think about that for a second. I don't want to spoil the answer for you. Armageddon Knight, oh my god. Armageddon Knight cannot be bottomless. Reset your bottomless. Oh my god. 
You can't even activate it. Like it's not it's not that hard to understand. He's 14, you need to be 15 for bottomless. That's fine. And it sucks I can uh, could have summoned exceed at one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I could exiton. Fuck. It's fine. Trapped Eris, right? Yeah. Now I know he has the bottom one, so there's no point in going to like super chocolate fudge cover now, is there? Absolutely not. I can go for a uh, double door of the Explorer though, and that sounds like a totally good idea. Yeah. Message in a bottle. Summon you. Summon doesn't matter. You. you. Doesn't negate. So, you can go ahead and chain that. It destroys it, but it doesn't negate it. That's fine. <sighs> if it says negate, then it negates destruction of spells and traps does not negate <clears throat> negate you can destroy them but they still resolve Yu-Gi-Oh 101 MST does not negate yes you oh my god I can't believe I gotta fucking explain this destroy my card, but it still resolves. I know what your card says. What, you just think that every time I activate a spell or trap, you can just be like, oh, get destroy, destroy, destroy? Like, no, no, no. That only worked on my call of the hunt because they have to remain on the field to resolve. But cards like this, it's Yu Gi Oh! It is Yu Gi Oh! 101. MST. And cards like that. Oh my god. Now the fucking that pro is being all slow again. Like look at this shit. Like look at this shit. I gotta explain to a fucking scrub. Like what the fuck, DN? DN, are you just frozen now? Again? If you're frozen again, I'm just gonna fucking end this video. I swear to god, like I do not have time to be dealing with your bullshit. Like, are you fucking shitting me? Why are you going so slow? Everything else uh, is working fine, but today, fucking the end's like, uh, I don't know how to do it. I don't know how to work. Like, all right. All right. All right. Yep. It, yep. Definitely just crashing. Yep. Everything else that I do, I put the video on pause to go ahead and see. Everything else on the internet is totally fine. It's only the end that's just fucking up. All right. I'm ending this video. I'm not going to sit here and, uh, you know, like, and uh, this point, obviously this person is a fucking noob, because if I have to explain to you that shit, that even if you destroy it, it still resolves, like, uh, fucking noobs, like, Yu-Gi-Oh 101, it, it's Yu-Gi-Oh 101, MST does not negate, you know, if I activate Regeki and you chain MST on my Regeki, it doesn't negate my Regeki, it's still, it's still going to get popped, so I don't even understand uh, why this would do it, you know. This seems like this guy, if this card said negated, this card would be pretty powerful. It would literally be like a fucking Shien. Like when an effect of face death spell or trap card your opponent controls is activate and negate the activation if you destroy it and then reset it. Like, holy fuck. Like this would be fucking 
st a fucking staple. This probably be it if that was good. You know? You just be like, oh, activate that fucking Necro's Mirror? Nope. Activate that? Nope. Activate that. Like, literally, you'd be a trap form of Shen. Like, whew, that'd be good, but no. The only reason why you would get me, because, you know, my cards have to, my trap cards have to remain on the field to resolve. But it doesn't work for this. And clearly, you can see Deanne's just being this booty. Two times in one video. Awesome. And th this is like hours apart. Hours apart. And it's still just fucking up. So, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and call it. So, uh, if you guys were wondering, I was going to summon the Galaxy Wizard, activate Galaxy Queen's Light, make them all 10, go into Adora, go into Adora, bam, bam, and then just wreck that bam, bam, biggity, bam. Terror with two doors. Ooh, but you guessed it. Anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed. So thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Hopefully, with Dian being better, than Cosmic Bell.